Welcome back to the Film Zone. Brandon Jennings' video is still down. The appeal hasn't even been answered yet. Uh, YouTube just doesn't want us to succeed, I guess. Um, but, you know, we're back. And we're here to make some more videos. Today we're going to take a look at Clay Thompson, shooting guard for the Warriors, and his 37-point quarter, most points any NBA player has ever scored in a quarter. And what we're going to see from this game is a lot of elite shooting from Thompson. That's what he does. He's one of the best to ever do it from beyond the arc. And a lot of poor defense from the Kings. And you put those two things together, an all-time shooter at his peak, and a poor defense, and sometimes offensive magic can happen. Let's go check it out. We'll start here. And right away, we're going to notice how the three-point threats that the Warriors have are going to open up space. Start at the bottom right hand of your screen. You're going to see Curry's defender right on him. He's never going to leave that position, and that opens up a ton of space elsewhere. And then we're going to see the screen attempt from Draymond here. Clay ends up going the other way. But you're going to see Green's defender steps up as if Thompson is going to take that screen because he needs to be there if he tries to pull up coming around the screen. So you see the space that that allows, and Thompson's able to drive, and he's going to get a wide open jumper. Most teams will allow that mid-range shot, so that's why you kind of see the nonchalance from the Kings defense there. Then Thompson's going to get the steal here. We're going to head in transition, and part of this is Curry again. They don't want to leave him alone, but part of it is just terrible defense. They step off of Thompson, and he gets the wide open look in transition. And here again... You're going to see Kane's defense there. They have a choice between Curry with the ball, a cutting Draymond, and Thompson out on the wing. They shift a little too far away from him, and that leads to an open three. This is just good two-on-one execution from Steph and Clay. Not much Collison can do to stop the bucket there. Now, unacceptable error from Stauskas here. You're going to see him go under the screen and then have his hands down here. That's easy money for an elite shooter. Just not good defense from a rookie and we're gonna see again on this possession Thompson gonna take the ball up he's gonna get the screen from Bogut Stauskas is gonna try to go under again Cousins is gonna hustle out there to prevent the shot but again Stauskas just kinda of standing there away from Thompson hand is not up and if you're the Warriors you're liking your chances on that shot going in now we're gonna see a bit more of a set play here ball is swung and you're gonna expect that drive right down the middle there, but instead Bogut and Green are going to shift towards the paint, take their defenders with them. That leaves Thompson some space on the top, and it's good defense, but great shooting beats great defense sometimes. And we're going to see that again here. That's it's good defense, great shot. This possession, we're going to see that magnetism of Curry again. You're going to see Stauskas top of your screen glued to Curry, no help offered there, and that's the game plan. But defenders, a little slow to react, see the weak side defender cannot get there in time. And that's an easy layup for Clay. Here, not terrible defense, but it's not good enough. You see lack of urgency on the closeout. This guy is actually shredding you in this quarter. And you just can't let him shoot it like that with that much space. Not bad defense at all here. Stauskas learns his lesson, doesn't go under the screen, fights around it. Sticks with Thompson, then the big man picks him up. Forces him into a contested mid-range jumper. You'll take that all day if you're the defense. Thompson just better here. And we're going to see another poor closeout in the corner top of your screen is where you're going to see Thompson. And you're going to see there, hand is not up. Unacceptable. He has 30 points in the quarter at this point. Cannot let him shoot that. We're going to see a classic play for shooters here, the elevator screen. And it's going to start with Thompson setting a quick screen for Livingston to get him open. Then you're going to see David Lee and Draymond Green coming to set that elevator screen. Thompson's defender realizes too late that he needs to run. Then Lee's defender realizes the same thing. Credit to him for hustling, contesting the shot, but Clay's not going to miss that at this point. And he's going to finish the quarter by getting fouled here. Makes the shot even though it doesn't count, just because he can. And he's going to get to the line end up with 37 points. And this game became a big part of Thompson's case as one of the best shooters of all time. Just has that ability to go off, dominate a game with his offense like almost no one else. It was a special performance from him. And for the Canes, 
This is just kind of how the night went. Go get him next time. If you made it all the way through, thanks for watching. How'd that get there? Ha. Huh. Anyway, thanks for watching.